In this video, we'll take a look at adding center marks to the slot here in a drawing in SolidWorks. Uh, maybe it's just me, but I always have a problem getting these slots to come in. And I don't know why SolidWorks has such a problem with this. Again, maybe it's just me, but there is a way around this. When you go to add the center mark and you select on the arc, maybe I should say this, SolidWorks I'm guessing does not create the center mark automatically like it did for the circles due to the fact that this is not a complete circle. So one method that I have found is if you click on the arc, it puts the center mark in the center of the slot, which I can't ever recall seeing a slot measured this way. If I deselect the slot center mark option here in the property manager. That slot then goes to the center of the arc where hopefully you would desire it. Since this is already unchecked, I can come in and put in these other slot center marks as needed. If I didn't do that, if I only put the one in, Deselect slot center mark. Okay, I did that slot. And now I gotta do another slot. You have to select that same option again every time you come to put the new center marks in for a slot. Okay, so there is another way. It is a option. I want to choose slot ends. If I choose slot ends, it will put them in on the ends. I don't know why the default option is to put it in the center of the slot. From here, you were just adding dimensions, distance from center to center, whatever dimensions you are looking to show. I can add a dimension. Why is that being such a problem? I know why, because the slot centers them back on. Deselect slot center mark. And I'll come back in and I'll add my dimensions distance from center to center. I think this one had the distance here of 56. So that is how you add slot center marks in a drawing in SolidWorks.